Hello, this is Mike, NoStressMike.com. Uh, I want to talk a little bit about zombies. And uh, the reason I'm even, uh, even thinking about this is uh, I, I scan around a little bit on YouTube, and one of the people that I, I watch and, and uh, listen, and he comes up with uh, uh, ideas and, you know, just the stuff like that, kind of like me, just uh, uh, shares his thoughts. And uh, he was talking about uh, zombies. And then that's when I realized uh, what he thinks on zombies and what I think on zombies is completely different. Um, uh, now, I, uh, and, oh, and it's, um, his name is Jimmy Rant, and uh, the link will be down below. And, uh, but anyway, uh, when it comes to zombies, I really, the, the idea of zombies, I, to me, comes across as mindless, mindless individuals that are told to do something or are made to do something and they do it as a herd. In other words, they don't have the mental capacity to think for themselves. Uh, they have no, uh, no moral strength. Uh, everything that I talk about uh, zombies do not have. They don't have any kind of abilities, they don't have any skills, uh, they have uh, nothing of value, nothing. And uh, the thing is, uh, on the movies they show them as, you know, uh, you know, walking slow like that. But that, I, I think, is just just what they're illustrating is how, and they're all walking together. It's just it's showing like a bunch of cattle that are uh, feeding. You know, they just kind of just kind of go along and graze as they're doing it, but they're doing it faster than what cattle are. And cattle are the same thing. They're they're kind of mindless. Uh, I say I, I work with cattle, and we just kind of we move them from one field to another. We work cattle. We do this stuff. They're just kind of mindless and go along. And they do what they're supposed to do. And that is what uh, zombies do. And uh, give you illustrations of what it is. Um, it'll be kind of like uh, uh, when, okay, now uh, I, I talk, mostly I talk bad about law enforcement, police. Uh, and the reason is they do a lot of zombie type activity. In other words, they're mindless. You uh, listen to them talk uh, when they, when, you know, when they stop you for whatever reason or something like that. Uh, they they talk uh, without emotion. They they, they talk, uh, you know. Could I see your uh, identification, please? You know what I mean. When you read the words that they're saying, it sounds good. But when you see the way they say it, uh, it's kind of like they're mindless. Uh, they're just like robots, you know. So, um, uh, and so, and this is what I'm saying, they are doing what they were instructed to do. And uh, that's, that's the way they are. They do not take personal responsibility over their actions. And one of the main reasons why, you know, I'm not saying I'm, I know a lot of times people think I'm picking on the police, but it's not like that. I, like I say, I'm 65 years old. Uh, I've uh, trained SWAT teams. I've, uh, I, when I was younger, I wanted to be a, a peace officer. And, uh, but, you know, I, I worked with them, and uh, that's when I realized I don't take instruction well. And uh, police officers take instruction well. And that's why many military, ex-military, become uh, law enforcement, is they take instruction. And that's another thing that's kind of mindless, is um, the military. Uh, and I noticed the military has changed a lot, too, along with law enforcement. And the thing is, they don't take personal responsibility. None of them do. And um, so when, once you don't take personal responsibility, and as you know, uh, my videos are all about taking personal responsibility. And so once you do not 
take personal responsibility, you are a zombie. You are being told, you are being led. You don't have the mind capacity to think for yourself. And uh, that's what makes a zombie. Uh, gangs, uh, and you can see it when they're, you know, 14, 12, you know, this type of stuff. You know, they're just doing what they're told. And, uh, you know, they have no concept of the value of life. And uh, they don't know what work is. Nowadays, it's l illegal for a lot of these young people to work. And uh, like I say, when I was young, everybody was working. If you were capable, you were working. So, and then with uh, uh, unemployment the way it is, this is all leads to mindless. They're unemployed, they're waiting for their unemployment check, and uh, I don't even know if they go out. Uh, years ago, they used to go have to go look for jobs and stuff like that. And now I don't even know if they have to do that or not. But what I'm saying is, once you get on the government payroll, you're right back to your, uh, uh, you, you've, you're not taking personal responsibility. You mindlessly follow. And this is what I'm, I'm saying when I talk about uh, we'll give up our guns and, and in 90 days. I made a video on that. And we're right back to the reason is these people are going to snitch on you. These people, they work for the government. They get a check from the government. And they're going to get in, in Cuba. When I was in Cuba, every time they snitch on somebody, they get an extra five pounds of rice that next month. So uh, that's what I'm saying. This is what the United States is set up on. 911 was, was, came about, so then you don't have to take any personal responsibility. You just snitch on others. This is what it is. So in other words, our society is turning into zombies. Mindless, uh, mindless, uh, not even individuals. They're just, uh, and they're not even humanoid. Uh, because I say, they don't have concerns for others. Uh, you can hear it in the, the education system. They're taught to all this stuff. You know, we're all colorblind. Everybody is equal. You know, I mean, stupidity is running rampant. These are all what I would consider zombie type mentality. And the, even though the movies uh, simplify it a lot, you look around and you watch, uh, especially you watch bureaucrats, you go into government offices, you watch them. They're mindlessly doing what they're going to be doing. They're zombies. This is Mike. Not a zombie. No stress, Mike.com. <laughs>